Hi everyone, so this is like my crazy hair. Um, it's definitely like frizzy. I don't know if you can really see that on camera. Um, and just nice knottedness. So I am going to try your show's new shampoo. So I'm going to shampoo my hair and come on back. So coming out of the shower, shampooing my hair with the Bior Show Be Gentle, Be Kind, Banana, Coconut, Nourishing Superfoods. So definitely smelling this one. It does smell kind of like banana, more banana-y, but almost like that medicine kind of banana smell. Maybe not a little bit on that natural banana smell, um, but it's probably more of what a natural banana would smell like. Um, and this one has slightly more of like that natural banana smell, maybe a little bit more coconutty, vanilla-y, right? So you're definitely not going to misplace these in the showers because they're br nice, bright, and yellow. Uh, again, like it's not too thick. I did find this one not lather up as much as the matcha uh, green apple one, um, but I do find it just kind of like as thick for the conditioner. So kind of just going through and brushing my hair. Whew. It's definitely like not bad because it definitely had like a giant knot that's still kind of there. So definitely going through, like it doesn't feel that hard to brush through, like knots kind of do come out, right? So sometimes when my hair is that knotty, I honestly have to put like conditioner in it and like try and brush it out in the shower. But I was able to kind of brush it out. So that is always good. And I do have like really easily knotted hair. So I'm just going to kind of twist uh, back a little bit and then I will check in to see how it dries. I do think like I did like the green apple one and I was like ah, I don't know if I would kind of repurchase it um, and that just because of the price point <laughs> but obviously it is something like I would kind of repurchase because they had something kind of new and I was like oh okay because um, I did like the green apple matcha one so I will kind of see how much I like this one. Checking in with my hair, I do think like there's still frizz to it, but it does feel soft. And what I find sometimes happens if I don't put any other product in it. Um, so this is kind of like just as it is, uh, if we can see kind of some of that frizz and whatnot. Um, what I find when I don't put any product in is it kind of gets like knotted in the back, which didn't happen. So I do think if you have kind of like knotty hair, then this is just going to kind of make your hair a little bit like healthier. So I think if you have that dry hair, it's something nice to kind of try. If it's in your price range, I feel like if it's not, then you can add kind of like your hair oil or like a moisturizer, like leave-in treatment would kind of give you a similar result to that. But I do like it. I have used their green tea matcha one and I'm about like three fourths the way through the bottle. Um, I would just say like if you don't really like strong scents and bananas not one of your scents that you like you do kind of have that smell stain your hair. It does go a little bit more like this nutty vanilla smell and it's not as bad or as noticeable I find as the day goes on but I feel like you want your hair to smell nice like my hair definitely still smells that way so I would say 
definitely if you can pick it up in the value pack, then it's kind of like worthwhile. Uh, cause you can get, still get like a good use out of it. Um, it's not like it requires a lot. I would say with this one, I found it didn't like lather up as much as the green tea matcha one. And again, kind of using, a scalp scrubber I found kind of helped lather without using as much product. So thanks so much for watching guys. I hope you have a great day. Bye!